The My Audi app is a great tool for getting important information and interacting with eTron. My Audi app provides information such as the charge state in percentage and charge status, which indicates whether the vehicle is charging or not. At the top, we also see the electric range available based on the current charge state. Let's click on the charge planning section to see what other information is available. When the vehicle is plugged in, we'll see these lines in green and they'll be black and gray when the e-tron is not charging. Again, we see the electric range but also other important information such as the remaining charging time and end of charging time. A valuable measure that's also provided is the charging performance displayed in kilowatts. This is a fast and convenient way to find out the performance of the charger. If charge times are not meeting expectations at home or at a public charger, this measure will indicate if it's a power issue at the source. For example, e-tron 55 Quattro is capable of delivering 9.6 kilowatts on a level 2 charger and has an associated charge time of approximately 10 hours from empty. If charge times are longer, it's very likely that what is being delivered to the vehicle from the charger is less than 9.6 kilowatts. Finally, if the vehicle is plugged in but charging has not been initiated, this can be done remotely from this screen by pressing the Start Charging Process Now button. Next, let's click on the timer at the top of the screen. Now here we have the ability to adjust departure times to ensure proper preconditioning of the cabin. After clicking on the timer, we can adjust the departure time here, and we can indicate which days of the week this will apply to. For example, you may work from the office on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday and need to leave at a certain time, but Tuesdays and Thursdays work from home. From here, we can manually turn on eTron's preconditioning feature. The climate control system will start a countdown to ensure the cabin is ready at the designated time of departure. Let's go back and click on the settings button at the top right. Here we can choose to unlock the charging plug after a DC fast charge has completed. This is considered to be an important courtesy in the EV community. If you're plugged into a level 3 charger but have left the vehicle unattended, this will allow another person to transfer the plug to their vehicle once charging on your e-tron has completed. Let's go back to the main My Audi screen. As we scroll down, we see some familiar My Audi features before coming to additional e-tron specific information, including a quick view of the timer schedule, as well as the stationary climate control feature. After clicking on this feature, we can immediately start the preconditioning process by clicking start climate control, or we can set a specific time by using the timer function. If we click on the settings, we can set the cabin temperature and control the surface heating of the windows, as well as select which heated seats we would like to activate. Preconditioning the cabin is an important step for range maximization. Doing this step in advance of your journey while the vehicle is plugged in helps to avoid an unnecessary draw on the battery while driving. Going back to the main screen and scrolling a bit further down, we have data on the average energy consumption for which we can see additional statistics. And a final e-tron specific feature of the My Audi app is to search for electric charging stations, which we can do by clicking the navigation pin at the bottom of the screen and tapping the charger icon at the bottom left of the screen. The My Audi app offers many features that support the e-tron ownership experience.